Good morning, everybody. This is Mike Lung over at Allendale's training floor. It is April 29th and starting the day off with a relatively quiet market compared to what we've been seeing here recently out of the overnight sessions. Uh, you got corn, beans, wheat all up about four to five cents. You got the dollar a little bit lower, crude marching a bit higher with some of those back months seeing breakouts. So we'll dive into some of these fundamentals that are driving the row crops at this time. On the news end of things, we're looking at open interest down for both corn and beans pretty significantly on the futures with what looked like a very good short squeeze yesterday in these May July spreads with commercials trying to pry as much grain out of farmers' hands as possible in order to meet supply needs. Uh, so we'll be watching what happens with the soybean corn index if uh, cash bids out in the country and uh, start to back off which we have seen a little bit now especially with the uh, a lot of commercial switching to july of what they're pricing off of and should be at this time so we'll be watching and monitoring what the catch cash situation has in store for us and also these export sales here today looking at uh, some potential cancellations on old crop beans most likely with the intention of switching those out to new crop for corn still pretty good old crop exports is what we're looking for today so after last week's uh, not incredibly impressive export uh, sales report we'll be watching that pretty intensely here today to see if demand is continuing and continuing to shrink the ending stock number in the trades mind on the livestock side of things box beef mix with choice up a dollar 51 select down 53 cents and carcass down two dollars and 47 cents for the pork on the technical side of things we're looking at this corn chart most active which lies your front month and seeing that rejection here yesterday at just about where you needed to 62 percent retracement of that spike high to low of yesterday well, yesterday night with that very quick sell-off uh, and then rejection again. So we'll see how we interact here today, if we get another push lower here once the day session opens. But with this open interest decrease, and especially with the very lackadaisical wants to jump on the back of this rally uh, with new buyers, it's definitely something to be watching pretty intensely here with the thought of potential panic ensuing if we start breaking some of these very minor support levels and not really having too much in the way of support on the way down until you start to see some of these breakout points. So we'll be watching that, see if there is some buyers that come into the mix that want to propel us back up to these highs. But that is yet to be seen here today, and you really need to see that 730 export sales report uh, to look for demand. If you guys have not signed up already, you can get a free one-week trial of our premium research. Please call Zach at 800-262-7538. Any questions for me directly, 815-578-6177. But today for Allendale, this is Mike Lung. You guys have a great one out there.